That would pop it right into mission two. If you get a B or before that, one. then you can get base. You, the best rank. You can get bass. There's no E. Well, bass or bass. Depending on whether you're talking about a fish or music. True. It stops at D. You can get cads. I'm not going to hinder my performance just so I can <laughs> spell things. Spell funny words. <laughs> This game rocket. doesn't deal <laughs> that <laughs> well with the port to PC. Just relax. Like it runs okay until you start cutting things up into lots of tiny pieces. Can you hear but it right? keeps dropping my cursor into the middle of the screen. I noticed that. <laughs> yeah, thankfully that's not being captured for the stream. From your foes, and two absorbing their electrolytes. I got it. Yes, enemy cyborgs will provide plenty of MCFs. That's right. Enemy cyborgs are full of electrolytes, cyber lights, and turbo lights. They're terrorists. I was planning on that anyway. Oh, and their left hands, if you please. Excuse me. All part of a Is balanced a diet. Data stored on holographic memory. That's right. Doctor wants left, left hands. hands. That data is very valuable. <laughs> His collection of left hands. Some of them are special, but you also always get a little bit extra BP for cutting their left hand off. That's terrifying. Had the world come down a few years earlier, I would have a Nobel Prize for my It does actually have a collection. I always forget if that's real or I just imagine that. <laughs> it's just absurd enough. Looks like we don't need to worry about interceptors. Great. Then we have time for a quick brief. I know you miss me, Kev, but I've been all over the materials. <laughs> That's what you said before Montenegro. Look, just humor me, buddy. Objectives, of course, are enter Abkhazia, neutralize the terrorists, and restore the rightful government, or what's left of it anyway. The all right, now we are in kind of generic post-Soviet bloc country. The terrorists brainjacked all the high-ranking officers, and their cyborgs scattered the rank Brainjack people. The few leaders who have survived have no way of openly opposing the new regime. Yep. That's so you're playing an action ghost in the shell now. Andrei A little bit, actually, yes. Leader of the occupation forces, an extremist linked to both the St. Petersburg massacre of 2015 and last year's terror spree in Georgia. And his arms supplier, none other than Desperado Enforcement L. Desperado. Yep, they're the bad guys. Imani's killer. They're the bad they military company. We're the good military company. Are you sure? Yep. Maybe you're all evil. The only problem I Jetstream is Sam. They all have such stupid names. What? <laughs> They're yeah. all like water related, aren't they? Wind related. Oh, wind. That's what it was. Yeah, there's. Sorry. Or like storm related or something. Yeah, there's. Im, Monsoon, Sundowner, and Mistral. Why land the plane when you can launch Raiden like a human torpedo? Let's go. Do it. Do it. He's a robot. He doesn't care. Yeah. Oh, man, he made a rainbow and everything. Well, he's an anime pretty boy. Slow-mo pre-rendered water effects. Should have landed in the city and just flattened the city. <laughs> just turned it into a crater. I forgot if he's still wearing heels. I didn't notice. Probably. Need some dolphins jumping in the background there. <laughs> does, does he have jet heels like right, Samus? You landed no. safely, duh. First head inland. Uh, yeah, he's still wearing heels. <laughs> make him run faster. It makes no sense at all. Cat. Oh, I have. Kitty. I have the like rage mode still. Hi, kitty. It's robot oh. cat. Cut off its left paw. I can't. <laughs> the cat is immune Don't to. Do that. The cat is immune to my attacks. I should bring him with me. He'll be the ultimate warrior. You can just drop him into all the enemies and they won't be able to do anything about him. Nope. Then he'll, I don't know, drink all their milk. Using stealth cable to ambush you. Nice try, 
but it won't do any good against a state-of-the-art cyborg like you, eh? Very to very incoming people, throw out your own barrage of light attacks yeah. while your is off the attention. And robot juice. Arr. That refills your health completely and your blade mode. Just from, like, exploding it in your hand and spraying it all over yourself. Yep. Yep. Right now my two big issues are getting hit from off screen and I cannot juggle to save my life yet. Oh. Had your fill? Better learn how to do that. Um, also I keep trying to hit left trigger to block. Uh, not only is that not block in this game, it's get your ass beat while you try and go into slow mode. Mode. <laughs> Because in Wonderful 101, that's the block button. Is that, is that the pudding button? Yeah, that's the pudding button. Mm, pudding. <laughs> you press it and it just dispenses pudding. Yep. Best button ever. <laughs> dispenses pudding out of, like, the controller speaker. <laughs> just starts oozing pudding. The tablet, it does have a lot of capability. Yeah, they still don't even count PMCs in official death tolls. With SOP out of the picture, private militaries needed a new edge on the market. We got it. In a way, cyborgs are just SOP troops by another name. Only all muscled up and less predictable. But it makes you wonder, less predictable. Where'd Desperado find these guys? I'm not complaining. They're like walking vending machines. <laughs> right. Vending machines full of blood. <sighs> Vending machines Easy full of skittles. Like said, there's still Wait. people. People who terrorize and take innocent Old lives. Delicious robo juice nodules. When they took this job. Full of all, all blue nerd trope. Damn. It's a bit cold, right? Even for you. Anyway, uh, his school. Let's get to work. Time to increase the peace. Increase the peace? Yes. Ez, pieces of robots. Because I'm going to cut them. <laughs> the Reese's pieces? Yeah, no damage. S rank. I'm awesome. Alright, go away. I got places to be. <laughs> You're like, look, game, I appreciate you telling me how awesome I am, but I really need to just move forward. <laughs> Good. Let's recap the route you will take. As I said, I'm here. I know where I'm going, Morris. You can, <laughs> you can shut up. This is where I need to go. Right here. I'm gonna just rub my crotch against this box for a little bit until he's done talking. Cross the bridge into the old town, then head down to the rear of the refinery. Still, man, I got shadows turned down. It still looks pretty good. They will probably have a grand reception awaiting you at the old city. Do not let your guard down. And up we go. We. I hardly need to pick up anything. I have enough bits of equipment. Yeah, I mean, if you're getting all the. I, th I think he doesn't want it. You don't want to skip the dialogue, right? Yeah. I'd rather just like the mandatory dialogue. Leave it in for a bit of continuity's sake. Yeah. In the lower and soon enough, I guess you'll. Well, maybe I don't know how soon. But you'll reach the point where you've already played through, and then you'll actually want to listen to it. I think I finished chapter three. Oh, okay. So you're a decent ways through. I mean, uh, comparatively to the beginning of the game. I don't know how long the game is. I mean, it's an action game. It's not that long. <laughs> just keep slicing. Yep. Well, I accidentally destroyed the thing, so... He's just a puddle. Yeah. I skip a lot of dialogue, because I'm trying to get the achievement for hear most of the codec calls. So you end up hearing a lot of them more than once. Raiden, take that main thoroughfare. You can use augment mode to see where the enemy is located. Your body analyzes radar and IR data to construct oh man, your AR display. time for detective mode. Huh. Yep. Some civilians are still in the city. That is not yeah. good. <laughs> mask? No mask. Also, these guys are pretty much deaf. You don't need to like. Nice. You don't need to actually sneak, sneak. You just kind of. Just 
don't be seen. Oh. Yeah, if you kind of flail around too much, trying to get cut through the box to get the robo juice, you end up destroying it. No, don't destroy the Gatorade. You need that. Sneaky. Eat it. There we go. One slice. Well, I've been using the. If you use the attack buttons, uh, you kind of just spam ran pseudo randomly, either vertically or horizontally. Oh, right, yeah. But so if I use the right stick, I can very precisely aim. Uh, oh, it's just these two guys left. Oh. I need a gif of like Raiden right slicing up pizza or something. No, I'm not doing Can we just yeah, let's just stun these guys. Dance for me. <laughs> now, if you're close enough, you can cut through both of them at once. But I wasn't. And we rescued a dude. Yay! Once those guys finish exploding. Get to death, let him know he is safe. Oh, Gotta let him know he's safe. I will not forget this. Uh, if you run after him, you can slice him and cut his clothes off. <laughs> because why not? Sure. And cutscene. Moving robots. What? Moving robots. In the first place? What kind of legs does that robot have? Like None now. Legs. <laughs> it's like Mark. muscle fiber. <laughs> <laughs> the muscliest legs they could create. Pretty much. Come on. Stop dancing around like an idiot. Yeah! yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Got it off screen. Off-screen. Oh, you can't strip that guy? Whoa! Oh, crap. I know you can do it to, like, posters of, like, women or something, like, I don't Yeah, know. there's some, later on, there's some posters covered up by caution tape, and you can... Oh, right, that's what it is. Uh, B ranking, because that one guy came out of nowhere and hit me. Very good, oh, right. maybe you'll spell now, a silly word. A <laughs> maybe you'll get abs. <laughs> Maybe I will. I think I S-tranked the first one. I think you did, yeah. So, and I don't think SB spells anything. Maybe you'll make. Maybe you'll get Sparrows. <laughs> <laughs> yes, the mysterious R ranking. <laughs> this is the only thing I can think of that has SB. <laughs> Speaking of pizza. Exactly. Fits goes with the theme. First time I was playing this, I didn't realize like the stealth kill was a separate button. So I just smacked the guy in the back. <laughs> That's <always> fun. Nope. <laughs> yes. The return of strong bad. Could get S B A D rank. Oh yeah, they found me. Oh no, oh no, fucking rocket launcher guys. Now I'm gonna imagine all the dialogue as voiced by Strong Bad. Okay. But there's no Bowser in this game. No. It's not really a character so far where that works. I, I don't think Raiden as Strong Bad or. Where's that rock? There he is. Come back. Really come back here so I can slide kick you. Do it. Kick the rocket back. Can you, like, parry the rocket and send it back in his face? Because that'd be amazing. Oh, damn. Green robot juice. Yep, they are full of green robot juice. That's no good. We need the blue stuff. Oh, and the legs bleed red, apparently. It looks like. Yeah, I want them to charge at me so I can do this. 
Aha. The robots are actually just powered by high C, so that makes perfect sense. It's just okay. different flavors for oh, each I got an achievement. Part. I don't know what it's for. Cool. It's you're just slowly rotating upside down. <laughs> are you, like, backpedaling while upside down? No, I'm just cutting up that guy into 300 and... Oh, damn it. I was reading the parts list. He was kind of doing like a side flip, but it was in slow mo, so he's just kind of like <laughs> gliding away while. Oh, that's. Slicing. Sad robot. The, the bottom meter, I assume, is your, your blade meter? Yes. I was gonna say the blue meter, and then when it ran out of usable amounts, it turned like disgusting green. <laughs> I was like, wait, it's not the blue meter anymore. Is that like three sections, but the first one is huge? Mm -hmm. Or is that the... Oh, yeah, that's like my initial section. Right. And then I've got two expansions so far. Oh, okay. I didn't know if it, it was like separate uses of it or something. Or... No. It's just more so I can cut things for longer. Right. Yeah, I gotta pay attention to the combat. Can't be reading about how awesome I am. Then I stop being awesome. Cyborg. See, it's not QTE game, because that would have been a QTE. Press X to not get your chin cut off. Yeah. Uh, the best part is I'm playing this on a PlayStation controller, but it gives me the Xbox button prompts. No, uh, oh, no. Press X. Oh. Which X? Which X? Any think... game that I play is like that because it, I'm using. I always use a PS3 controller emulated as a 360 controller because everything just has like natural 360 controller compatibility. You are. I am IF prototype LQ. And yeah, X is definitely the worst because it's the only one that's on both controllers. Thankfully, when it shows the QTEs, it'll show the whole controller and then which buttons to push on it. So I can just go by location. I forget what game it was. Maybe it was one of the God of Wars? Where it like put the button on the like side of the screen that related to the button. Yeah, that was God of War 3 did that. <laughs> So, I, I like that because you could actually look at the center of the screen and focus on what was happening. And then when you saw something flicker on the side of the screen, you knew which button it was just by where it was in relation to the center of the screen. That's it. So you didn't have to, like, stare at the QTE to see what it was. The worst, I think, was... Um, playing uh, Resident Evil 5 with mouse and keyboard because you can aim and shoot better with a mouse, but all the QTEs then are using, like, the keyboard buttons and stuff. Oh, but it's not going to be any, me. like, normal button. Right, which is weird for me because I have the keyboard set up, like, all the controller, all the controls, like, rebound right. to weird things. <laughs> so, like... My use button was uh, is usually for games I have it on like numpad zero because it's right next to the arrow keys. Right. But all games read that as keypad inserts. Oh jeez. So it, it pops up with a button that says like KP ins, and I'm like, what? <laughs> what? <laughs> what the hell? Because that's what it is if you don't have the num lock on. That's great. Yeah, it, it, it's the insert button off the keypad. Right. So all the prompts come up is like KP ins. <laughs> Shut up! I'm fighting a robot dog. With a chainsaw tail. And I think I had the, I think like the thumb button on my controller wasn't like reading properly for it, so I just simulated it as like the minus button on the keypad so that it was like out of the way and I wouldn't hit it accidentally. So then when that thing came up, it was like KP minus. <laughs> These are the worst button problems. Because usually it'll say like press E. Yeah, it'll be like up. Q and E or, you know. Space or something. Or something <laughs> normal. Space for I like if it's jump or something. I usually re rebind it to like middle click. <laughs> right. Are you fighting puppies? I am fighting robot dog. I am kicking robot dog's ass actually. 
Here you are. Now I'm not going to because it's time for removing robots. Oh. Uh, fun fact, I got this far without realizing there was a lock-on button. Oh. oh. I parried too early, apparently. Oh. I'm still always surprised when the execute command comes up on the screen. <laughs> like, oh, I can kill it now. Yay. <laughs> yeah, poor robot dog. He's dying horribly. He's not doing his really hard to dodge attack. Now he is. I was gonna say, you said it, now he's gonna do it. It's... Use your intellect, my blows. Use your intellect. Yeah, parrying that, like, multi-jump attack is kinda hard. Let me get close to you so I can murder you. Never. There we go. Yeah, he's done. Bye, robot dog. You. Oh, I expected that barrel to explode. Nope. I just kinda got knocked out of the way. So many pieces. You're right. Alright. Oh, oh. Kill the dog. oh, parts of them are too far away. I can't cut them anymore. That sucked. How is he talking? I, I don't know. <laughs> just a piece that's just still spinning. What would an that's just a, that's just like the BP pickup. It, it looks like it's part of it. And then it explodes. Oh, well then. Oh, you can click in the left stick to move while in blade mode. Nope. Uh, I hit one on blade mode and guys just fall too far. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. They just drop to the ground and you're like, oh, I guess I'll just poke the ground repeatedly now. <laughs> Cut Come you on. a few more pieces. Yeah, fuck your shield. Your shield too. Come on. Take their Gatorade. Can't when they're flying. I think I failed. Yeah, I failed to get any Gatorade. Oh. We're not gonna start naming them all the juices like we did for Quantum Conundrum, are we? No, it's only blue. Gatorade. Only blue Gatorade. Yeah, I haven't really found a use for being able to move in Blade Mode, but I guess, yeah, to get a little closer to some guys might help be helpful. Except half the time I end up being in the air when that happens. But you could you could be cool guy and like run down like a path and just swing your blade repeatedly as you run past everything. You don't really run though. You just kind of waddle. Well, it's in slow mo. You're running. You just can't see it yet. To everyone else, you'd just be dashing down to the middle. Just now we're fighting. Now we're fighting helicopters. Yep. Come on, let me. There we go. Let's see how you fight helicopters. Kind of boringly. Oh, that one just kind of came down after you. It's not. It doesn't strike me as a very helicopter y maneuver. <laughs> Trying to yeah, like, dive is. bomb into you. He's blue, so I can cut him into bits, but he's all the way over there now. Parry it. You can. When he charges you, you can parry it, and it's pretty much an instant kill. There we go. Yeah! Cutting the helicopters apart is what makes my computer chug. Because they're so big, so you can cut them into so many pieces. I kinda wish you didn't open the chests and you just, like, sliced them up. You do. <laughs> well, you that one you... looked like you just popped the lid open. You cut it open. Oh. I mean, like, I wish you just, like, sliced it in half and then <laughs> got the item. I wonder if you can, if you, like, go into blade mode on the chest. Nah, you still just... Oh. Love my EM grenades. 
I, I don't know if it'd be cool or annoying if to open the chest you had to go into blade, blade mode and like actually slice the top open. It'd probably be cool the first few times, and then oh, you just... Guys with guns! I hate you. Oh no. Gun that... beats sword. Gun causes very small amount of damage to sword. Well, gun causes very small amount of damage to cyborg. Who then uses sword. But gets rid of my not getting hit rating. Missile! Okay. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It's always frustrating. You're like, yeah, you have a cool combo and then like, you just get blasted by something on screen. Like, oh. Look at that! Yeah. There we go. Ruins the cool factor. That, yeah, like, sometimes I'm trying to par parry charge moves, but I think because they come from above, the game doesn't quite know what to do with them. Right. Because you can't hit the stick up to parry it. You, you saved my life. Thank you. So that's where they're holding up. Some kind of electronic lock. On or the game. flying dude. Most likely it opens only if you have the right ID data stored in your left hand. Perhaps you could find a cyborg with access and uh, borrow it? Yeah, you find somebody's left hand. Dock? Why not double back? Check the vehicle route again. You know, back at the entrance to the old city. <laughs> Who knows? Maybe you can hitch a ride. Most likely platoon commanders carry correct ID data for I the game. I can't go any farther an back than this until they're done talking. <laughs> I feel like they could have just done that, like, while still letting you run around at regular speed. And then if you really wanted to listen to it, you'd just stop and listen yourself. Fox. Fox. I'm sneaky. Meek, meek. I cannot AR mode in the box. I looked for a moment, I thought that man was carrying a giant shield that said TGT. It's the, uh... Oh, no, now it's LKD. I'm locked on. Changed his allegiance. And now it's just a big red splotch. I wonder where that came from. Yeah. Nobody heard that. Do you get extra points for getting the, the juice? Yes. Okay. Uh, I know you said it like heals you up. At the end of combat, one of the uh, ratings will be Nandatsu. And, and that's how many of them get in. Yeah. Okay. He's got his Zendatsu everybody. Come on, come back down. <laughs> He's already facing people again. I'm, well, yeah, that's why I suck at juggling. I keep... Keep, I keep launching them into space and then not knowing where they are. And not knowing, like, how to follow them. You gotta learn the timing so you can be really cool and, like, launch them off screen. And then I don't think wait. I cut his arm off correctly. <laughs> I did not. He will respawn, though. Right. You... you missed them all? Ah, uh, well, you just have to fight your way through. Or not. So no. can you actually, like, go, like, do different things to get through? Yeah, I can do... this. Right, but I mean, like, he said, like, uh, looks like you'll have you to do so much for that. Looks like you'll have to force your way through. Like, are there other ways you can do it where you actually, like, sneak in with them? If I, well, if I cut that guy's arm off, I can just unlock this door. But since I had to cut it off, there's guys in here with guns drawn already. Oh. So I have to cut that down. And then they fall. And now we can fight. <laughs> I'm gonna hide over here from the guys with guns. Now you can fight like men. Cyborgs. Ow. Sticking grenade, I was about to be awesome. No. Grenade says no. And... Yeah, so these guys are paying the ass because they will do nothing but shoot at you. That 
guy's like a big dude, too. He is. And if he I like counter him, he will counter me right back. Oh, man. Except the other dudes keep getting in the way. Oh. Killed a small fry. I love watching the parts count just rocket after like the first few slices. Oh, I don't think I got the other one. Nope, it's the one. But now I can fight this guy normally. So you have to do like parry battles yep. until they stop. They're awesome. So it's like it's like playing Soul Calibur. Yep, and they'll go back three or four times. Okay, that fight went terrible. I probably got a D rank. That's still gotta be. Maybe you'll get Babs rank. Mm, already got pretty much all the collectibles. Oh, okay, I'm going this way. That's the way Raiden wants to go. Yeah, Ninja Run can be a little difficult to control. I think that's like the most noticeable flaw in in like most modern games that have that sort of feature. Is it like never goes where you want it to. There's always instances where you're like, oh, I'll just run straight across this and hop there and hop there. And then you run and he like jumps to the right and you're like, no, that's not where I wanted to go. Well, even with the camera turned all the way up, it still takes a while to spin it around to see what you're doing. That woman. That guy's not wearing the sleeves of his coat. Because he's a cool guy. Ryan looked so shocked. Right? She's like, oh. Your heart rate spike. If um, if you call Doctor at this point, he tells you that her right. breasts are I'm probably real. Thanks, oh. game. Yep. Man, why can't Ezio get down buildings like that? And he also made a path up in case he falls. <laughs> 